Hello Hicktubers and welcome back to my channel and today DIY project is a homemade LED light bulb and why I'm making my own LED light bulb because I'm tired of buying a low cost LED bulbs with no quality at all and today project which is a LED bulb that includes a transformer that will never dies. Let's start! Starting the project with the Piranha LEDs that I bought from AliExpress for around, I don't know, $6 for 100 pieces. And these chips are 0.5 watts. In today's project I'm gonna use 9 pieces of these LEDs. So 9 times 0.5 is 4.5 watts. So today LED homemade bulb will be 4.5 5 watts. The first thing that I need to do is to solder the 9 LEDs to the, the breadboard adding the resistors. The resistors are 1 ohm each for the array. I'm soldering 3 LEDs in series and adding a 1 ohm resistors. Uh, that I'm doing for, for better quality and if each array is dying the other will work for sure. The LED board is finished with 9 Piranha LEDs and for each array I use 1 ohm resistor, 3 resistors and the power supply is set to 9 volts and we're gonna see it how much current is pulling this guy. Wow, it's bright. 180 milliampers at 9.3 volts, working perfectly. Okay, good. Next step is making a bridge rectifier out of four diodes, one N4007 and one electrolytic capacitor, 1000 microfarads at 16 volts. Okay, let me explain the circuit diagram for making a homemade uh, LED bulb. Uh, from beginning we have an AC voltage of 220 volts that goes to the transformer and from here we get a 9 volt AC that need to be converted in DC so that's why we are using a bridge rectifier and after that we are soldering a capacitor of 1000 microfarads 16 volts three resistors, one ohm each for each array. Each array is made out of three LEDs that are connected in series and the ends are going to the positive. That's it. I got everything prepared. Here it is the base with the transformer inside and I fixed with the screws not going anywhere. These two wires are giving AC voltage of 9 volts that need to be connected to the bridge rectifier that I made out of four diodes and one electrolytic capacitor and from here positive and negative wire will go into the LED board made out of nine Piranha LEDs with total watts of 4.5 watts. Let's connect everything. Okay. 
I need to isolate the wires from touching the metal that will be very dangerous so I'm putting a heating isolation okay. like this Great. Fitting nicely everything. And I have this lid that goes on the top. And here will go the LEDs. Okay. Final steps. Now I'm going to test it. Okay, three, two, one. Wow, it's super bright. Just to kill the, not the other light. Working perfectly. Some of the LEDs will light for a while, but that is nothing. Four point five watts out of nine Pirana LEDs, and each LED is uh, zero point five watts, and this will pull one hundred and eighty milliampers. Great. Thank you for watching and see you in the next project.